it's like a school dinner's shepherd's pie. Hi, my name's Vanessa, I'm a mum of three, and today I'm trying other mum's shepherd's pie. I like cooking shepherd's pie because you usually get two nights out of it, so it gives me a night of cooking. <laughs> Well, when I make shepherd's pie for my family, they wolf it down. If I don't taste it in the kitchen and have a spoonful or two, I don't get any. Being half Jamaican, I like to add a little bit of spice to it. Hot Maggie sauce and chilies and a bit of Jamaican seasoning. I've got a thing for putting Philadelphia cheese in my, in my mash, and I did. Loads of butter, a tiny bit of cream, or well, maybe a lot of cream. I like cream. I put onion in the mash, so it gives a nice little bit of crunch. I put a little bit of cheese on top, so it just gives it a little bit of golden colour. I use the vegetable juice as a sort of stock base. I cook a lot of African type foods, so the sauce will have sort of African spices, that sort of stuff, to zhuzh it up, to lift it up, because I think spices really bring something to a dish. Otherwise, it's all a bit bland. If it's bland, mm -mm, I won't be feeling, and I will say, I won't hold back. What makes my pie the best is because I'm perfect and everything I cook is perfection. <laughs> oh, at least this smells good, actually. It does smell really good. I think they've got tomato in there. There is definitely some sort of tomato in here. I think green makes food pop, you know, a bit of veg or herbs or something. So, um, shame there. You know, presentation, but it's not always about presentation. Taste is more important, I think. There isn't much seasoning in here. That's a shame. The meat is a little bit lumped together. The mash is too watery. There's no green, no herbs, no, no, no flavour. I think the potatoes are a little bit bland, sorry. But it, it's got a nice taste to it. And I quite like the tomatoes in it. You've got to have spice in your food to elevate it a little. And there is no spice here. The aroma attracted me and I thought, oh, there's going to be something here. But when I got to it, Really, there, there was nothing. It's like a school dinner's shepherd's pie. I think this gets a five. This gets a five. I would say I would give this a six out of 10. I wouldn't be borrowing anything from this recipe. No way. <laughs> I think my shepherd's pie is the best because it's got lots of flavour. Hmm. We'll see. Oh. <laughs> mm, I don't like the smell of that meat. <laughs> <laughs> I don't like this. It reminds me of my partner's mum. If I saw this in a restaurant or somewhere, I wouldn't go for this dish. It doesn't give me that come and get me. There's a blandness, there's something that's it's just not doing it for me. It's really watery. And I'm going to say this, it's cheap meat. The mash looks nice. I like the brand on top and that you've done the fork thing with it. Oh, that gravy is really thick. There we go. Moment of truth. Mmm. It's really sweet. Really sweet. It's really it's sweet. So I just put sugar in it. Oh, the, the, the mash isn't doing it for me either. Her potatoes, her mash is really good. I have to say, it's not a lump in it. It's better than what I anticipated. This is lacking in spice. It's not seasoned enough. You know, that warmth in your mouth, something that pulls everything together, it's not there. Uh, there isn't anything I really like about it, sorry. Because of her mashed potatoes, I'm gonna give her a six. I'm gonna be very kind here. I'm gonna give it a four. I wouldn't order it for a second time at a restaurant if I got it the first time. It's not on my cooking repertoire at all, but um, when I do make it, it is good. This is a posh shepherd's pie, most probably from West London. <laughs> to the eye, it's aesthetically pleasing. The little baby carrots, they look really cute. They put an awful lot of effort into that. I like the carrots on top. Or do I? Oh, no, I don't ever do it, actually. And this one looks like it's got tomato in it as well. Maybe I'm doing it wrong. Beautiful. But does it taste good? It's just like mince and mash. It's got flavour. It's not sweet. Even the colour of the meat, you can tell she seasoned it. And the mince is... A little bit chewy. It's quite bland. The mash is gorgeous. 
Mine's an East London one. This is a West London one. In terms of the carrots, I think they'd be better off in the shepherd's pie instead of on the shepherd's pie. I would feed this to my family. I would serve this to my family, but I think they might be a little bit disappointed. Grudgingly, I have to give this shepherd's pie a nine out of 10. I don't like this woman, even though I haven't met her, because it tastes good. <laughs> I would give this a five, because I think it's lacking a lot of flavour, which is a shame, because it has got potential and they've really tried. You've got to give it to her. I should have given the other one a four. Yes! My food had flavour, greatly presented and delicious. Do you know what? I'm humble about this because I have to say that that fancy West London shepherd's pie was beautiful. I'm a bit disappointed because I would think that mine was full of flavour and goodness. I know, some people like bland food.